All right, Baggies fans, welcome back to Talk West Brom. And uh, just so you know, Remain Soilers is about as useful as a chocolate teapot. Oh my God, he's just so weak. He's so weak. And um, he's not even like Gundogan is, uh, is a big physically imposing player. Yes, he was almost unplayable in the match today. He was godlike and was really stepping into that De Bruyne-esque role, stepping up to the plate. But goodness me, the main Sawyer is having a terrible, terrible game. Um, the goal where the flag was raised and then the ball was put in by Cancelo. Okay, on one hand, the flag goes up and players for ages have been drilled into their heads to stop playing when the flag goes up. But you need, especially at the top level, to play to the whistle. And it's embarrassing that the whole team pretty much just stops. It's like, oh, oh, uh, Concello's got it now. Oh, it'll probably be all right. He'll probably put it wide. Oh, it's back in that. Two-nil two -nil down or whatever. Do you know what? It's not It's not good enough. Like, not only are our players not technically or physically good enough in the Premier League, they're not mentally there. They're not mentally there. They haven't got the the cutthroated um, the, to to thrive in the Premier League. They haven't got the got that 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 clinical side to them. It's not good enough. You get punished in the Premier League for these silly mistakes for being lily livered. And I Sawyer's just floating around the pitch with his chewing gum or whatever. He's actually not as much to do with his ability. It's to do with his effort, his work rate, and just. His head is not where it needs to be. I don't know why he's been starting for us. You know, Gallagher on the bench. I mean, come on. Gallagher is one of our best defensive players, actually, in midfield. And um, also good on the ball. And um, you can't question what Sam Allardyce is doing, starting Sawyers over Gallagher for this game. I think it's absolutely insane. Absolutely insane because Soy isn't going to do anything to stop the, the rampage in Man City attacks. So it's really hard to fathom. I mean, you're bringing Sam Allardyce to, you know, be better defensively, and we got a 1 1 draw with Billich. Now, yes, yes, Man City are perhaps, you could say, in better form than they were when we last played them, but, but come on, come on. You conceded like so many more goals at home than anyone else in the league. The Hawthorns is like far from a fortress, it's the opposite. Teams come to the Hawthorns to the confident of getting points and three points, and rightly so, on our on awful home record. It's just not good enough. It's not it's not good enough. And unless a miracle happens in the last few days of the transfer window, then like it'll be very tough to see us staying up. Like if we lose to Fulham, which is obviously a huge game then uh, it's going to be very, very hard. Um, again, it's just on midfield. He's causing so many problems. Uh, well, also, not only midfield. Like, people like Dara O'Shea. Like, I don't know why Bartley wasn't playing, to be honest. Like, O'Shea, like, Gundogan just went around him so easily. Like, it's just it's just insane. Like, it's just... Yes, Man City's squad a lot more expensive, but you can be resilient. As we ourselves showed against Man City previously, but we're just so naive and that naivety and just weakness is really, really, really costing us this uh, season. It's just becoming an embarrassment. It's just becoming an embarrassment. A lot of players, yes, playing above their level, but the mental side of the game is just not there. It's just not there. Sawyers needs to stop starting for us. Uh, Put Gallagher in. Grzycki, who's a Polish international, Get him in. Maybe we'll have a chance. I don't know. See you later.